Cyprus got a guy number eight on the, going to contest for the for the kick off number eight Biko. Uh, plays for Pontypri uh, uh, Rugby Football Club in Wales. He's a big guy. He's going to create uh, some damage. Um, but uh, the Czech Republic did well to uh, retain uh, the kickoff and look very, very organised. Swing the ball from side to side. But still stuck in the 22, can't get out. Oh, and uh, oh, yes, Cyprus number 12 As did well to Marcos, uh, plays in Holland, uh, he's a fly off and he's a top, uh, uh, top point scorer for, for, for Cyprus. Cyprus. Like I said, uh, Cypr Cyprus look very, very organized, you can see they've got experience, they've played at a high level and they're going to, uh, they rank second in, the in pool A behind uh, uh, the Netherlands, and I fancy them to uh, to make the make the final, well. and maybe uh, even uh, uh, beat the Belgium side. So misconversion, uh, quick try by Cyprus, five nil. Let's see how uh, um, Czech Republic. From the kickoff. The Czechs have uh, maintained their uh, position, playing the patience game. There we are. Good nice break. break. Nice break from there. Well, he, oh, he passed sorry. himself. That's a that's a new move. Knock on by uh, Czech. Quick ball. Number ten lost the ball there, Jack. The referee letting the game run, which is always encouraging. Oh, unlucky! Yeah, two on, two on. Here we are. We never managed to score. Switch your phone off, man. What's wrong with you? Switch it off. Switch it off. No, then you maybe switch it on now. What's wrong with you? Cyprus put it on, the, on their own scrum on the line. Um, let's see if they spread it out and try to run it out or they try to kick for, for, for possession. Let's see if they have the scrum time. Yep. Cyprus scrummed well. Kicked the ball out. Jack plays for Henley uh, Rugby Football Club in the UK. He's only 18 years old. And this is his uh, first time in a European Championship, the tournament. Not, not in straight. Israel versus Lithuania. Big mistake by the Czechs. You, as I said, at uh, the set pieces, you've got to win your set pieces. And there's an opportunity at the line out to do it. It's not difficult in the um, similar side format to win your own line out. Um, and uh, Czech Union didn't get the ball in straight. Gibbs, uh, Cyprus, scrum in. They're defending in the 22. Oh. Good break there. Massive. But the number 11, he doesn't have all the, pa all the pace to get all the way there. He's waiting, he's being patient. Still got the ball, unbelievable. And this number 8 should stroll to the line. Oh, oh number 11, Reno. He plays in France, he uh, plays in wing, he plays for Montalencon in, in France, he's the 15 aside uh, team manager and he did exceptionally well to, to break from his own half 
and um, and to score the try at the end. Weather-wise, Cyprus is also a little island in the Mediterranean. Beautiful holiday resort, lovely place to go to. Uh, been there myself on a few occasions. The, so the weather shouldn't be too much of a factor for uh, for the Cypriots. They should be able to deal with it uh, uh, quite well, much better than uh, our, uh, our colleagues from Europe. So we'll have to see as the day develops what happens with this. The Cypriots number nine just missed the second conversion. Uh, his name is Zhao, and he uh, studies uh, his master's, master's degree um, in biomechanics. Only 22 years old, and he's a flyer in the 15 aside. These conversions could be could be uh, crucial. Um, missing conversion, so it's always great to have a great uh, place kicker that can uh, just add those two extra points. Oh, nothing oh. to save the post. The checks just looks they look uh, bemusels. Yeah. They they don't they don't seem to uh, get anything right. I don't know if it's the the pressure that the Czech Repu uh, sorry that the Cypriots are putting on them or they just haven't landed in Israel yet. It's still on the plane. Number twelve for for Cyprus, Marcos is he's the guy in the center of the field. He's rushing up on defense, putting pressure on the passes, standing in the in the passing lanes. Wow, he ran, he ran. Here we are. That's it. He needs support. He needs, he needs support, support, number seven. Pass it to your mate. Good defense there. Here we are. Uh, but yeah, sport's quick enough to, to score the try. Here we are. That was good defense by the Cypriot side, but uh, the pass was made at the end. And the support player in uh, from the Czech Republic had enough gas to, to score the try. Well, they finally have landed. Uh, I guess they listened to what I, uh, my I comments. Say. Yep, so uh, both kickers are not doing really well with the place kicks. So the, tr the score is 10 to 5, Cyprus. Just that, that brings them back into the game. Bottles of water flying all over the show. Having to drink here, you can dehydrate very, very quickly. Water and ice, that's key. Cool themselves down. A bit of a breeze has picked up a bit, uh, you know, that might help a little bit. Wingate is located on the on the coast, and um, so it's it's humid here. Um, but there's always the breeze from the from the from the ocean, uh, cool breeze coming in. You see the flags, flags uh, are, flattering. are flattering up here at the commentary booth. We don't feel it too much, uh, but in the afternoon they should pick up a, a bit more. Let's see what Cypress got. Well, that number eleven is running through people. It's like a pocket rocket, that guy. Well picked up with his good laces. Here we are. You see both uh, they, the Cypriots uh, players have got great technique, running with the ball in, with two hands, um, making it harder for the defenders to guess what they want to do. They can pass, they can kick, they can, they can uh, shivvy, they can hand off. Uh, all you young players watching this, that's key to uh, run the ball with two hands. Uh, you have the ball tucked under one hand, they know what you do. You're not passing to anyone. When the ball in two hands, you can pass right and left. At the moment, as we stand, the, the, the Cyprus team look, look the most dangerous of all the teams that we've seen so far. They've come up here with a game plan. They uh, run into space. They create the spaces for themselves. All through the tries they've scored so far has come very, very quickly, very easily. And uh, they don't seem to, uh, they they seem to have too much problems uh, with creating uh, even when the tries are scored against. Who's this to the game? Your wife. I'm calling her, I'm calling her. He doesn't know. He sent hundreds of emails. Yeah. 
Yeah, Bins, you can't find me. Yeah, I'm busy broadcasting. Okay, so... Okay, okay, fine. Phone, phone him, phone. 5100. Phone him, 5100. Okay, bye. Oh, I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to get it. I'm Game starting now. Second, sorry, second half is starting now. Um, Czechoslovakia kicking off from right to left, from south to north. In front of the kicker, another silly error. Free kick for Cyprus, halfway line. Check at 10 meters back, and I'll have to defend. The big guy, number eight. Hasn't been involved too much. The separates number eight. Like to see him ball in hand running into people. But they're spinning the ball wide, catching the ball in with pace. Advantage the uh, check they did well right. to counter the ruck and win the win position. But they're going nowhere until now. <laughs> Cypriot's got some very small guys that are just causing uh, nuisance for the Czech uh, players, running around them, between them. And, um, and making it harder for them to make the passes stick. Some substitutes. Cyprus has just changed their number eight for another big guy. Scrum top. Here we go. Again, the number nine, the separate number nine, the short fella. Once again. Very quick around the ruck, around the scrum, and just uh, uh, tackled the guy with the ball and made uh, made him knock on. Once again, scrum time. Cyprus put in a big push, hassled the uh, Czechoslovakians off the ball, and now they get to put in. I think the Israelis are going to have problems. Here. We don't think we have a. A physic physicality in our team. We got uh, some clever rugby players. Ooh! But uh, we knock we on the advantage, Cyprus. Yeah, like Milton said, we got problems with. Uh, we don't have uh, too many big guys. Um, and we're gonna. We're gonna. Shot. Um, put in Cyprus on their own 10 meter line. Good defense by, by the Czech. They won the ball. Number 15. If you can get he his pause away. He runs like a giraffe. Mm. Ball's been thrown around here. Not great rugby. A lot of knock-ons. Oh. This is uh, this is not great rugby by both teams. I don't know how there hasn't been one knock-on there, but uh, play on. That's what we want to see. What is happening here? The referee's got the referee's got his hand out. <laughs> referee has to call this to an end. People are knocking on, throwing forward, backwards. There wasn't one good pass there. But okay, scrum down for, for the Czech Republic in the, the Cyprus 22. They got a big uh, uh, open side. They got a big uh, area to, uh, to make a move, to draw a defender in, 
to make a, a sidestep and to, and to score a try. Cyprus put in there. Cyprus put in, but oh, there is a try there still. And the number, uh, the scrum off of uh, Czech won that ball somehow and Vaslav scored it. Jursic. Vaslav Jursic. Great try. Score now 15 10 to Cyprus. Czechs probably still feel they're going in with a chance. Good conversion. Score is now 15 to 12, Cyprus. Czech just needs a try to just needs a try to win this game, doesn't need a conversion. That's why I'm saying the conversions are so uh, vital. Um, the Cyprus missed three conversions and the Czech made one out of the, out of the, th out of the two. Cyprus knocked on the ball there, trying to catch the ball. Check ball. That's, a, that's why, why uh, Sevens is so wonderful. The, the, the game changes. Uh, any, it's anybody's game. You can't uh, um, predict. You can't predict. And, and, and the team's got in the chance until the final uh, second. So uh, we thought it's finished. But quick try by Check. They got in that position. That's an offside position by the... Uh, the Cypriots, there's an advantage here. Let's see if they can do something. That's a clever kick to the corner. Let's see who's going who's gonna to win this chase. It looks like the Czech is oh, going to score. Yes. That's a great try. That's a wonderful try. That is magnificent. That's great vision by the, 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 the fly off of the center from the Czech Republic. He saw there's nobody behind. We saw that in, in the previous game when um, uh, the Polish chipped uh, and, and collected this time. They used the boot to uh, uh, kick it into space and the wing chased and uh, dotted the ball down uh, before the Cypriots' uh, defense uh, got there. There's uh, no question about it, uh, Jonathan. It is a tactic that you have to use in seven aside, this, this, the, this kick. Uh, you're, going to be, you're going to use it cleverly. You're always frightened that you're kicking away position. The coaches don't like it too much, but I believe it's a tactic that has to be used. Plenty, plenty of tries can be scored, are scored from that little chip kick, from kicking, from kicking to the corner and chasing. Um, we see the, uh, the Fijians in the heyday used it a lot, and uh, they scored many, many tries that way. Right, the score is 19-15. We're into the final minute. Game on. That's a long kick. That could go dead, and that's a free kick. No, no but he collected the ball, uh, the Cypress Cypriot player, and let's see if he can do something. They have to they have to score that this yeah. try a hundred meter try, um, but I think they got it. They got the they got the chance. They got the plays. Well, they just they looking also. Look at that. That's that speed there. Someone has to tackle this guy. Oh, oh that's oh, unbelievable. Right. Oh, he almost knocked that ball down. That's a hundred meter try. Five seconds for the to the end of the game. Cyprus with the winning try. That is an, am to that was an, ama that was an amazing try. In the dying minutes of the game, Cyprus uh, scores and they will, they will win this game. 2019. That's the second try by number 11, Reno, who plays in professional rugby in France. Um, that is an amazing try, I, I must say. Yes. Good, good game of sevens once again. Great score. And. Uh, to uh, Cyprus, the diamond. So now, this is it. Game on. It's us now. We've got a few minutes now uh, um, before the national side play uh, players come on. The, the Israel national side players come on. Um, Dad, you, you were captain uh, Israel 15 aside. Uh, in 1981, the first international game against Sweden, sorry, Switzerland, and he tied the game. Um, I, uh, I've been uh, lucky enough to, to captain the side, and also my, I, my younger brother Nimrod uh, captain the 15 aside, and he's also captain the, the 7 aside uh, side today. A uh, lot of pressure on him and on the, on the, on the team to perform, but uh, I'm sure he's going to lead by example. Oh, yes. Uh, the sevens uh, is the Israel national seven team has been uh, chosen uh, by the Israeli Olympic uh, Committee as a team that they want to try and develop.
for the Olympic Games to try and get him into position to compete uh, in the Olympic Games in 2016. So uh, a lot of effort and uh, time, money has been put into the, uh, the Israel 7th side tournament. And obviously they're in, the, they're in the building stages now. They've been together for the last six months working very, really hard uh, to try and develop themselves. And uh, today's a big day for them. They really would like to perform well. Uh, we're all very keen to see how they have, how they have pr uh, progressed and uh, how well they've done um, uh, and how they're going to click. Uh, they're walking out now. Uh, the teams will be uh, coming out soon. So let's you, let's uh, talk about key players in the national side. Uh, as I mentioned, Imor is uh, the anchor in, in the forwards. He's uh, um, the tallest and uh, one of the biggest players, and he's going to uh, uh, enforce his, uh, his size on, uh, the, on other on our teams. We've got uh, Ethan Humphreys, uh, the number 10 uh, flyer, uh, who plays in who lives in England and plays in England. Um, he's going to be uh, directing uh, the play. Uh, we've got another great player, one of our best players in the country, if it's uh, Modi Radoshkovic, uh, who's got the, he's got the size, the speed, um, and he hopefully is going to create uh, uh, room for our wing, Adrian um, uh, uh, Reinstein, who, who's got the, he's got the, he's a rocket pocket, he's got the, he's got the speed uh, to, to score in the corners. Uh, but it's it's all I think it's all about defense. It's all about pressurizing other teams to make mistakes and then taking opportunities. Uh, if you can take your opportunities uh, when when on, when they're on hand and uh, just pressurize our team, uh, that's a key uh, uh, ingredient to, to win. Absolutely, uh, Jonathan. And it's also when you have the ball in hand, try and be patient. Try and move the ball. Try and move the ball around. Not to not to put yourself under too much pressure. Try and get your players into space and uh, maintain ball retention. The uh, the Israel rugby team I see are lining up to have their photos taken at the moment, and uh, we wish them the best of uh, luck for this tournament and obviously for this this game. Uh, I'm very honoured uh, with you, Jonathan, to to call this game, and uh, we just wish uh, wish uh, our national team uh, all the best, and uh, hopefully they're going to put up a good show today and for the rest of the the tournament. Uh, the rugby has taken off dramatically in Israel over the last uh, few years. Um, we have done very, very well in the 15s. We have come up over 40 rankings in the last four years. I think it's unprecedented in, uh, in, the, in the rugby world. I don't think any other team have, uh, has climbed so much in the rankings as uh, the Israel national team. We're getting, we're getting good, we're getting good uh, support. And as like today, Israel versus Lithuania. Israel with the white shirt. Teams are coming up to the field now. Led by Nimrod Kaplan. Led by Nimrod Kaplan. Led by Nimrod So, Nimrod uh, is uh, leading the team with Modi Radoshkovic. Nimrod Kaplan. Modi Radoshkovic. Vitali Primak. Guy Matissis. Misha Eli. Eitan Humphries. And Adrian Reinstein. Adrian Reinstein. Yeah. This is